let's learn how to export text with a transparent background in Photoshop in this super simple tutorial. With Photoshop open, start by creating a new file. Go to File, New. I'm going to set up a simple web document, 1500 width by 1000 height, 70 to resolution, no artboards, RGB color mode. Click Create. Next, type out the text. Come to the Type tool, select, check my foreground color. Foreground color is black, happy with that. And then if I want to make changes to the text, come to Window, Character, and I can make any changes in here. Click on the canvas, type out my text. Select it with Selection tool, and I'll just use the Transform options to make this a little bigger. Press Enter once happy. Command or Control A to select the whole canvas. With the Selection tool selected, center align horizontal, center align vertical. Select the Marquee tool and click Off. Make the necessary changes to your text, font, kerning, whatever that is. So I very quickly added two strokes. Once I'm ready to export, toggle off the background. And now I'm going to show you two options. The first is to save as PNG. So come to File, Export, Export As. In all the versions of Photoshop, this will be in the Save As PNG. In File Settings, make sure your format's set to PNG. Make sure Transparency is turned on. Keep the width and height the same as the canvas. And once happy, click Export. Select the Save Destination. So I'm going to select my DWD Images folder. I'm going to call this Text 01.png and click Save. I can also export the text trimmed to the size of the text and not include the background space. I could go to the crop tool or I can go to file, export, layers to files, set a destination. So I've selected DWD images, press open. Export layers to files is used for multiple layers. So this is going to add a number at the end of my file, but I can easily go back in and change the file name. So I'll just call the prefix text. I can select PNG 8 or 24, depending on the number of colors that I have in my text. So this only uses three different colors, so I'll keep it to PNG 8. Include ICC profile, and then under options, then make sure transparency is turned on and trim layers is turned on. Once ready, click run, press OK. So if I locate my exported images, there's my original text 01.png with a transparent background. And then along with the background layer, then I also have a text 0000, delicious PNG layer, as you can see has been cropped to the size of the text with a transparent background. Let's very quickly put this to the test. So file, new, same size as before, click create. I'm just gonna add a background layer. So select my paint bucket tool. Let's change the color to say a blue. Okay, let's click add the background layer. Now, if I come to my finder, I can click and drag the PNGs into the document. So let's try text 01 first. Click and drag in, and there you go. There's no white on the background. So we know that works. Let's toggle this off, come back to finder, and now let's try the second PNG. Click and drag in, and there you go. The second one is also transparent, and this is cropped to the size of the text. So you can see a side-by-side -side comparison here. Both have been exported with a transparent background and the PNGs can be used in other files. So there you go, that's simple to export text from Photoshop with a transparent background using the transparent PNG option. I really hope you found this tutorial helpful and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, keep on designing and I will see you for the next tutorial.